Dear students today we learn about cloud architecture and anatomy of the cloud. First we will see about cloud architecture and then anatomy of cloud will be discussed. Cloud architecture Cloud computing is a revolutionary technology that enables access to various computing resources and services over the internet. It operates based on a specific architecture that defines how different components of the cloud work together to provide services to users. Additionally, the anatomy of the cloud refers to its structure, including the various components that make up the cloud system. Cloud Architecture Layer 1 – User Slash Client Layer the user slash client layer is the entry point for users to access the cloud. It includes devices like laptops, mobile phones, and tablets that connect to the cloud. Depending on their processing capability, devices are categorized as thin clients, low processing, or thick clients, high processing. Users interact with cloud applications through these devices, which act as interfaces to access cloud resources. Example from it industry. Imagine you are using a mobile banking app on your smartphone. The app connects to the cloud, where all your account information is stored. When you access your bank account through the app, you are using the user slash client layer of the cloud architecture. Layer 2 Network Layer The network layer enables the connection between users and the cloud infrastructure. In public clouds, the internet serves as the primary medium for connectivity. In private clouds, a local area network, RAN, is used. The network layer ensures that users can access cloud services with sufficient bandwidth and minimal delays. Example from it industry, when you use a cloud-based video conferencing tool to have a virtual meeting with your colleagues from different locations. The network layer facilitates the seamless communication between your devices and the cloud-based video conferencing service. Layer 3 – Cloud Management Layer The cloud management layer consists of software responsible for managing the cloud infrastructure. It includes the cloud operating system, resource management tools, and governance software. This layer ensures efficient allocation, scheduling, and optimization of cloud resources. Example from it industry a company using a public cloud service like Amazon Web Services, AWS, can manage its cloud resources through the AWS Management Console. The console allows them to provision virtual servers, manage storage, and monitor their cloud resources effectively. Layer 4 – Hardware Resource Layer The hardware resource layer comprises the actual physical hardware used to provide cloud services. In public clouds, data centers house a vast collection of interconnected servers and storage units. In private clouds, the hardware resources may be located within the organization's premises. Example from it industry, when you store your personal photos and videos on a cloud storage service like Google Drive or Dropbox. These files are stored on the physical servers in the cloud provider's data center, which is part of the hardware resource layer. Anatomy of the cloud The anatomy of the cloud describes the basic structure of the cloud system and its components. It consists of five fundamental components that work together to deliver cloud services. Application. The application layer represents the uppermost part of the cloud anatomy. 
It is where various software applications run and are executed. Users interact with these applications to perform specific tasks or access services offered by the cloud. Example from it industry, when you use a cloud-based productivity suite like Google Workspace, formerly G Suite. You can create and edit documents, spreadsheets, and presentations directly within the cloud application layer. Platform. The platform component lies between the infrastructure and the application layers. It comprises platforms that facilitate the execution of applications. Platform as a Service, PaaS, is an example of a cloud service that falls under this category. Example from it industry. Developers can use the Microsoft Azure PaaS platform to build deploy, and manage applications without worrying about the underlying infrastructure complexities. Infrastructure The infrastructure component provides the computing resources required for running applications and services. It includes servers, storage, networking equipment, and other hardware elements. Example from it industry, a company can use infrastructure as a service, ERs from providers like Amazon Web Services, AWS, or Microsoft Azure to rent virtual servers and storage in the cloud, instead of maintaining physical servers on premises. Virtualization Virtualization is the process of creating logical components of resources over the existing physical infrastructure. It allows multiple virtual machines to run independently on the same physical server. Example from it industry, using virtualization technology, a cloud provider can partition a single physical server into multiple virtual machines. Each running different applications and operating systems for various users. Physical hardware the physical hardware refers to the tangible computing equipment that forms the backbone of the cloud infrastructure. It includes servers, storage devices, networking switches, and other physical components. Example from it industry. In a data center operated by a cloud provider, racks of physical servers and storage units are interconnected to handle the computing demands of various cloud users. In summary, cloud architecture defines how different layers work together to provide cloud services to users. While the anatomy of the cloud describes the basic components that constitute the cloud system, cloud computing has revolutionized the IT industry by enabling businesses and individuals to access scalable cost-effective, and flexible computing resources on demand, leading to greater innovation and productivity in the digital age.